How is it going guys? Today we will talk about highly elusive and valuable 1970 Jefferson nickels. Now I'm holding just circulated specimen. Regular struck Jefferson nickels with no full steps on Monticello building. The 1970D nickel is common in all grades and can be found with ease in gem condition. However, none have been certified finer than MS66 by PCGS. Full steps 1970D nickels are extremely rare and worth at least $10,000 even at Midstate 66. The 1970S nickel is also very common in Midstate, especially in MS64 to MS65. According to Ron Gus from PCGS, even at even MS66 examples can be found, but anything better has not yet been seen. Full steps examples are scarce, but these one of few dates of mid 1960s to early 1970s that has decent population of full steps examples. This is 1970s nickel at Miss Day 66 with full steps from Steve Strom collection. This premium gem is tied with other as the finest full steps example at PCGS. The steps are completely delineated and satiny surfaces are beautifully preserved. Hints of nickel gold toning grace each side. It was sold for $6,462.50 in 2016 at Heritage Auctions. Here is another 1970s that made good money for its owner in 2021. Also at Miss Day 66 with FS designation. This is just such a rarity, its silver tinged surface is also expertly preserved to rank among the finest certified at PCGS in the FS category. Sold for $2640 at Stax Bowers. You should also definitely check out this error nickel from 1970 with meat mark D. As you can see from toning it was struck on 1970D cent. Red at Miss Day 66 red and brown by NGC. On this 6 cents error just enough of the date remains to identify both the cent other type and the nickel over type as 1970D issues. Pink and copper gold surfaces show lavender and blue hues which accounts for the red and brown designation. Sold on January 7, 2011 for $3,737.50 at Heritage Auctions. 